Let me introduce you to the Longoria family and Clara. <laughs> this seven-year-old has a new Grit Freedom wheelchair to help her enjoy the trails in her backyard in Avamore. This is a great opportunity to um, get around where I want to. There you go. And I, I can go on the dirt, the grass, the rocks. Grit wheelchairs were designed by two mechanical engineers that went to MIT. You, you push forward on this set of levers um, that come up from the chair that are connected through a chain drive. And so these are using your bigger upper body muscles so it's better ergonomically. Um, and kind of the cool trick just from physics is that depending on where you place your hands on the levers when you're pushing, you effectively are changing your gear ratio. So basically the Freedom Chair works like a mountain bike that can take adaptive athletes off the pavement. Just the wheels alone are very, they are very adapted to, to any type of terrain. And then just the control of herself. Uh, and it's also kind of, I like it because it makes her work as well. Teddy! It has been a year of firsts. Clara had her first cross-country skiing experience at Sun Valley, which also provided the Longorias with their first experience with the Challenged Athletes Foundation. And Teddy got the first ever grit chair built for kids. We're really trying to push the envelope on innovation and saying, how can we get our kids out there faster um, so that they can fall in love with the outdoors just as quickly as their peers? Today was where we knocked down one of those walls. And it all started with collaboration between the Challenged Athletes Foundation and Grit. That was my kid, The whole time. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? To design a chair specifically for kids. And since that day, the Challenged Athletes Foundation has given out 80 wheelchairs through their grant program, including one for Clara and two other kids from Twin Falls. Well, I'm also a new mom, so seeing the smiles on those kids' faces is like the best part of anything I've ever done at GRIT. <laughs> and for the Longoria family, who recently moved to Idaho, the Challenged Athletes Foundation has helped them fit in. And that's what's just so great. When you meet the people, you know that there's no limit to them uh, and no limit to what they'll go to for these kids. And I think that right there is what really explains who they are is there's no limit, there's no wall. We want everybody involved and we want everybody included no matter what's going on with you. And I think that's what makes it so great. And for Clara, she now has the opportunity. You go, you go, you go. Punch it, punch it, punch it. To have fun and play with her little brother and her family on her own terms. It was really painful for everyone giving me this chair. You're really thankful for it? Yeah, I'm really thankful for, thankful for everybody. Steve Dent, Idaho News 6.